Our community is both the ones that our business directly touch, our suppliers, our teammates, our customers, and it's also the folks that surround us in each of the cities where we operate. So to me, community means all of those people and all of the initiatives that are important to them. I think the different organizations community will differ. And I know um, for us as an organization, diversifying, um, our community was really built around those that were underrepresented. Um, and we really existed and were formed to try and make a difference to people where actually maybe there's systemic things that are against them. It is really the overall um, fabric of how those people live together and work together and support one another. It's about everybody pulling together. That's the simple way of saying what communities are and that you're not just a standalone organisation who doesn't, who is just focused solely on their end game. It's about thinking about outside your four walls. We think communities um, and companies obviously work side by side. You know, high streets play a pivotal role in defining a community. Community matters because it's that wider environment that you're operating within. It covers everything from diversity, equity and inclusion through to charitable giving and economic impact um, and even to kind of the supply chain and, and how you're operating within that network of your own business and organisation. So it's very much your organisation's community um, and where you are serving and supporting. I mean, if you go back to the fundamentals of uh, what what being a force for good means. Um, you know, uh, any organisation doesn't live in a vacuum, it doesn't exist in a va vacuum. It engages and interacts with uh, its immediate community on so many different levels, not just from employment, but to resource usage, to waste, to all of those types of things. And so being able to find ways to positively impact the community that you are operating in is absolutely fundamental to being a, a, a B Corp and why I believe that accreditation puts so much value on, uh, on community. Because it's not one person, right? It matters because there's a whole host of needs, aspirations, um, and knowledge and wisdom within each of the community members that bring us together in some united cause, united front. In many ways, we are all further apart um, emotionally and physically than we've ever been before. And you know, we're a company that straddles a lot of different types of communities. We have very rural fishing communities that we work with every day. We have very urban restaurant communities that we work with every day. And our job is to take two groups like that who see the world very differently and help them appreciate one another. Because without those customers and those folks working in restaurants, those fishermen wouldn't have anywhere to sell their catch. And without those fishermen, those folks walking into a restaurant wouldn't have anything to eat. And let's do that in a way that's very conscious and community oriented that actually gives due appreciation to everyone that touches that process. And if you think about everything that you do and consider it partly with a community lens, I think you can go really right with business. And I think it's good for business, but also I think it means that the, the residue that you leave behind, so the kind of the impact of your business tends to be a, a positive residue as opposed to a negative. We have a 1% um, promise. And so we donate 1% of our net sales into mission-driven organizations in our local communities. And so that's a really brilliant, tangible way of being able to see the difference that we make. We go directly to our source, it's really as a way to mobilize women and create jobs and opportunities. And that community is allowing us to really, to, to take those, to, you know, take those challenges on, not individually, but collectively. The Lift All Boats Project, which is our program to go out into local public schools and to tell kids from marginalized populations that lobstering is a career that can be available to them and then to help them overcome the very significant permitting obstacles and actually get the learning and mentorship that they need to break into that profession. Uh, that has been the, the achievement that I think we're most proud of. I think actually one of the things that we've been really mindful of doing is to actually look in the mirror first. And we're really big advocates of being the change that we wish to see. We've got that buy one, give one, buy one, give two model 
that is designed to support vulnerable communities in the UK and internationally who don't have access to underwear. Looking again at how we support people through the manufacturing process. So we use fully certified organic cotton. So it's all fair trade, it's got certified. And we support people, the community, um, through that whole process. And it's really clear for customers um, about the impact that they have by supporting us. Everybody is encouraged to um, volunteer in a local community-driven organisation of their choice. So I think it's really important that it aligns with your own values, your own passion points, because you're more likely to give more, but to do that within their working time, not to do it in their spare time. You know, volunteering can quite often be associated with painting a fence or tree planting, which are impactful, but actually much more relevant is how you can use your actual business skills for um, you know, uh, competency-based volunteering. When we looked at communities, it was like, first off, I thought, oh my word, communities, what's this mean? It was things we were already doing, like work experience. We were letting people come in and use our meeting room. Our CEO, he is on the Welsh Economy Alliance. He's a trustee on, a, on various things. So don't think about, oh my word, what do we do as a as a business, think about the individuals of people. People is just so important in everything. Like people is what makes the world go round. People is what, you know, drives passion, drives engagement. And um, people's just at the heart of everything in B Corp, in community, um, and even kind of technology, you know, it's people that makes everything happen. Mm -hmm.